Mr. Game and Watch. Let's go, baby. I'm back. You got a Game & Watch and... Samus, is that it? Yeah. Okay. You know what? I'll let it rock. Let it rock for a little bit. Sit back. I know nothing about these two players, but I know the characters that they play are cringe. So, it's just a matter of who's going to be lamer. Um, but you know what? They both have funny up Bs. They both have uh, down smashes that make me want to pull my hair out. And... Um, yeah, these are just like, like, I have a question for you. Who do, who do you play in this game? You play a Piranha Plant. This doesn't work then. Um, <laughs> but, okay. So, as a Piranha Plant man, what pulls you to a Piranha Plant? I think it's just like, it's a silly little guy, you know? Yeah, silly. I like, I like the silly, silly character. Yeah. No, like, for sure. You know what? If you're playing the character because they're silly, that's a good reason to play them. Um, but I look at these two, you know, they're locked in, ready to go. Um, and I just, I just, I just say why. Why? But you know what? Everyone has their taste and they're just going to keep, you know, pressing that B button and throwing out those aerials that are ridiculous and lame and cringe. But you know what? That's love of the game, baby. Not every character is going to be a winner. But I will say that whoever's playing Samus, holding it down real nice. I don't know them. I don't know their track record, record but they're le but they're uh, but they're ledge trapping. Pretty good. I rock with it. Ah, uh, you play them. You play them on Demon Hours. That's why. Uh, so I'm assuming Kamikaze is the seven? Yeah, right. I'm watching this inverted, so like, I don't... Thank you, Ocean Man. One, one.
know. Game two, Samus Game to Watch. Uh, what exactly am I going to be looking for? Uh, a lot of Nair. A lot of that from, uh, from Game to Watch. And then the second he can, uh, you know, get Samus off stage, just start throwing, just start throwing, you know, uh, Continental Breakfast uh, at, <laughs> at Samus. Uh, So I need to ask people why they play Samus, cause like, do they, do they, do they have fun? Yeah, I know you play these characters. You play these characters to make sure your opponent doesn't have fun. But the fact that they're playing each other means that both of them are sweating, but for the wrong reasons. They're just like, they're just hitting their buttons. Their B buttons are until one of them croaks. And just like that, Game & Watch croaks. I'm supposed to have someone else here for you. I, for, I don't know where my boy went, but you know what? I'll just, I can hold it down for a little bit. Like, like it's just it's just Game & Watch and Samus. Like, nothing, nothing crazy is going to be happening. Like, they're just going to be nairing. And then the second they get to 100%, uh, one of them is going to be spamming up smash, and then the other one's going to be doing that uh, morph ball in F smash or uh, charge shot. So, like, I'm not expecting anything too, like, like, like too uh, drastic. I mean, I mean, you never know. You never know. You know I can see it. See. Yeah, I can see one of them go for, like, the craziest blood school setup of my life. But you know what? Kamikaze just has it down. He's just, he's just putting him off, uh, putting a uh, KDX off stage and just, just running a train on him. That's just how it is. Is this tournament best of three or best of five? Oh, thank God. No, that's fine. I'm going to hope it's best of three. Kadex sitting on his final stock. Kamikaze, honestly, comfortably sitting at three. Like, I don't think, even though he's at 125 and Cadet is, uh, Kdex has been able to, you know, rack up a lot of damage. I don't think he, I don't think he has anything to worry about. He's in such a good, con like a, like a good game state. He's, he's fine. How did that Ubi connect? What is this bullshit ass character? Anyway, subscribe to uh, No Style Esports if you haven't already. I guess. I guess that's a thing I need to point out. Are they trying to make us kiss? Like, I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to do that right now. Right now, I'm... Anyways, uh... I'm just, I'm just waiting for, you know... Kamikaze to really, to just clean up the final stock. I feel like he's kind of got this whole game figured out. Uh... Unless Kdex decides to pull a 9, like a real OG. Uh... As for now, I'm gonna eat this McGriddle. I didn't learn until recently. Whoa, wait. I really wish that killed. I really, really wish that killed. And you get the boards back. Here's bullshit. All right. Now hit a nine. Just hit a nine, bro. Please.
Oh, we're back? Oh, okay, cool. You caught me mid McGriddle bite, but, you know? Why are we back on Smashville? Who picked this? You didn't win the first time. I don't fully understand the uh, the logic behind going to uh, Smashville again, knowing that uh, unless Kdex decides to make a few adjustments on how he's approaching these projectiles, he's going to be losing stage control every time. I feel like every time I'm looking at the stage, Kdex is somehow off stage. Um, so. I feel like he's just currently fighting a losing battle, but you know what? Maybe he knows something I don't. I'm gonna let I'm gonna let the chef cook. I'm gonna just let the chef cook, do what he needs to do. That shit's burned. I don't know if I want to keep, you know. I think I want him out of my kitchen. He might be he might be doing a little too much. That sequence is so dumb. It's so stupid. Y'all like my commentary so far? You're not getting quality. You're getting the truth. I'm a journalist. I get cold hard facts. Right? I report it how I see it. No bias. Absolutely none. I totally wasn't cheering for, for Big T Tar fan during doubles. Not at all. Back to the day. McDonald's may have all day breakfast, but McGriddles are only 11 o'clock. So why is there all day breakfast? Why does it matter? If you're going to take out the, the most goaded, like the most goaded thing on the menu, on the breakfast menu and take it out during 11. Oh, okay. So if I keep talking about McGriddles or like McDonald's facts, uh, maybe KDX will start winning. And so I'm going to stop talking about McDonald's. Uh, so the set can go by faster. So what you're saying is that we sue McDonald's? Yeah, you know what? Yeah. Yeah. Let's take him down. We'll take it back. We'll take we'll, we'll take down McDonald's. We'll take down the Golden Arches with our bare hands, gentlemen. Or whoever's in chat. However you identify. We're taking him down. And we're saying all day breakfast is no longer unless you give us our McGriddles at like ungodly hours. That's all I'm saying. So what do you think? You got? Do you think I should bring this uh, kind of commentary to uh, mainstream? And the up throw cleans it up. Kamikaze with the clean 3-0. Thank God. Yeah, I want the mid the mid griddle at 2 a.m. Uh, and 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 just 